All right, so I'm back, and today we're going to build the ultimate green goblin, which I'm guessing is going to be a pretty big letdown. Um, an ultimate letdown, if you will. Oh, oh, oh I'm so funny. Um, all right, so just uh, put this leg in. Put this leg in. From what I hear and understand, this is a retool of one of the Hulk figures. Not too surprising there. Alright. So there we got the legs together. Up. Oh, I'll put the head on. Yeah, ooh. Ah, oh, he's scary. Shoulders go in. Plug the shoulder in. Then you can take this piece here and plug it on his back. And there you go. <sighs> this is uh, th this figure right here is the main reason why I never read, or this character anyway, uh, is why I never read the Ultimate um, Spider-Man series. Just straight up, because that is not the Green Goblin. I understand revamping the character. Uh, I totally get that. But how do you get from this? Or get to that? From that. I mean, are you fucking kidding me um I, I i don't even know what to say here um i am a major green goblin fan i've said that a many many times this is green goblin this is this is something else this no uh, just just no um, all right so personal opinion of the characters uh, aside um, head is on a ball joint looks left and right it's got big horns spiky chin um, this kind of sits on his back doesn't really tab in there he's got a ball joint for the abs or whatever um, Shoulders rotate up and down. They go in and out a little bit. Bicep swivel, double bend elbow. Hands rotate, there's a hinge in there. Um, legs can rotate around, in and out, whatever. Thigh swivel, double bend knee. Uh, feet rotate. And there's a rocker. Um, I, I guess the figure's fine. Um, the character's what I really hate. Uh, these things just kind of irritate the hell out of me. Um, <laughs> a lot. Um, you know, I, I don't know, guys. This thing sucks. Uh, I hate the character to the point I can't look past it. I, I can't. Um... <laughs> Green Goblin, not Goblin. Green Goblin, not Goblin. I, um, for the figure, I'd give it a five out of ten. It's a disappointment. Um, the wave is a disappointment. So this is supposed to be the payoff. Um, the, the wave really is a disappointment. I, the, the beetle I like because I'm a fan of the beetle. Um, Black Cat is great and Carnage is perfect. Um, which means there's, depending on how, how much of the wave you're buying, that's there's four to six more figures that are crap. Um, and then the bill, payoff is this. That, that's more of a punishment. To finish the wave, um, that it is a, a, a payoff. So here he is next to Hulk. Um, yeah, 
Hulk better. Hulk better. Um, <laughs> here he is next to Superior Venom. Um, so yeah, he's he's a nice big figure, but it, not worth it. It's not worth it. Um, yeah, if you buy this set for Carnage and Black Cat like I did, you know you won't be disappointed with those two figures. But you're gonna you're gonna not like the rest of them at all. <laughs> not even the slightest bit. Um, I. I It's sets like this that make me question whether or not I should really be going all into the Marvel Legends. But uh, anyway, uh, I guess that's it.